Hello students of class 2. Let's do a new chapter today and it's the last chapter for our final exam and it's chapter number 6 multiplication. What is the sign of multiplication? Multiplication has this x sign okay before we did addition and the sign was this isn't it after that we did subtraction and the sign was this so please don't get confused with the signs this is multiplication this is addition and this is subtraction okay so multiplication is all about timetable you have to know the timetable very thoroughly here what we will do is we will do the timetable here okay and it's very easy 1 2 r 2 2 2 r 4 3 2 r 6 4 2 r 8 5 2 r 10 6 2 r 12 7 2 r 14 8 2 r 16 9 2 r 18 10 2 r 20 there are in every number there are two two gaps okay so in this multiplication you have to be very very thorough with the time level so let's do this one fill in the blanks okay the one they have already done for us so what is 5 4 r 5 4 r is 20 so we will write here 20 okay let's do the next one there are dash feet how many feet are there one two isn't it so right here two each foot has dash toes now you count the toes in one feet one two three four five five isn't it so you write here five so there are dash toes in all so what is two five r two five r is ten isn't it we will write here 10 if you count all of this it, it is 10 here okay let's do the next one there are dash stars how many stars are there one two three four five six we will write here six each star has dash points now you count the points one two three four five five isn't it so there are dash points in all six five r what is six five r 65R is 30, isn't it? If you count all the points here, it is 30. Okay, so you write here 30. Now, this one there are dash blocks. How many blocks are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You write here 5. Each block shows dash dots. How many dots are there? 5, isn't it? 5. So, 55R five, five is 25. Okay, so you write here. 25 now this one uh, there are dash leopards how many leopards one two three three okay each leopard has dash sports how many sports are there one two three four five five so three five r is 15 okay so you write here 15 copy this down in a net copy as well so we will do this one here 1 5 r is 5 2 5 r 2 5 r 10 3 5 r 15 4 5 r 20 5 5 r 25 6 5 r 30 7 5 r is 35 8 5 r is 40 9 5 r is 45 10 5 r is 50 each number has 5 5 each gaps okay so now you have to do this one as your homework and it's very easy see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 you just have to write the numbers according uh, go it serially like that and finish this up okay now here also this is very easy so you please do this complete this table and show it to me also you complete this one so even this is your homework and also this is your homework please don't miss any homework because for each homework for each project you will be getting marks so here Two groups of 10 R, okay? So 2 10 R is what? 20, isn't it? 2 into 10 is 20, okay? Six groups of 10 R. 6 10 R is 60. So 6 10s are 60, 
okay hmm. so we will do here exercise 6.1 fill in the blanks and give the multiplication sentence so fill in the blanks and give the multiplication sentence they did they or they've already done number one for us four plus four plus four plus four plus four is equal to 20 so five four r is five one two three four five isn't it so likewise we will do like that how many fives how many fives are there one two three isn't it we will write here three multiplied okay multiplied by now the number is five the common number is five isn't it five so 3 5 r is 15 you see it's 15 so we will do the next one how many one are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 right here 7 multiplied by the common number is 1 isn't it we will write here 1 so 7 1 r is 7 we will write here 7 so how many trees are there 1 2 3 isn't it we will write here 3 multiplied by the common number is 3 we will write here 3 so 3 3 are 9 we will write here 9 so the next number is 6 how many 6 are there 2 2 multiplied by the common number is 6 so we will write here 6 2 6 are 12 so we will write here 12 okay so uh, how many twos are there one two three four five six seven eight nine ten we will write here ten multiplied by the common number is two two so ten two r is twenty we will write here twenty okay so likewise we will do the next one fill in the blanks and give the repeated addition sentence they have already done this one for us okay so we will do the next one 7 multiplied by 2 equal to 14 so what we will do is we will uh, write 2 7 times how many times 7 times okay so 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus how many 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 isn't it now count it again 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 if you do the addition exactly it will come out 14 okay yeah. so now here 4 multiplied by 4 so now we will what we will do is we will write 4 4 times okay so like this 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 equal to 4 into 4 r is 16 isn't it so you write here 16 okay so now 2 multiplied by 10 okay so we will write 10 two times 10 plus 10 so 10 plus 10 is 20 we will write here 20 5 multiplied by 1 we will write 1 5 times like this 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 okay 1 2 3 4 5 isn't it so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 5 isn't it so we will write here 5 so 4 multiplied by 3 we will write 3 4 times okay like this 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 equal to 4 3 r is what 12 isn't it you write here 12 okay so it's just like this so turn to your next page exercise 6.2 find the product we will do the multiplication multiplication you just have to know the timetable okay what we will do here is we will use the timetable of 5 and then we will multiply it by 9 okay so 5 9 r is 45 5 9 r is 45 write it according to the box okay in your copy there is box isn't it so here you have to do the multiplication of 1 1 multiplied by 8 is 1 8 r is 8 if it's single number then don't write on this side but write it on this side okay 
and here it's double number so please don't get confused zero three see zero three r is zero one three r is what three isn't it you write it like this so now here two multiplied by eight two eight r is sixteen isn't it you write it like this here one uh, zero nine r is zero and then one nine r is nine you write it like this okay zero seven r is zero here five multiplied by eight five eight r is forty you write it there are 12 slides in the park there are five children on each side how many children are there on both sides they have already done the one for us there are 10 children isn't it so likewise we will do the next one okay there are two seesaw in the park there are four children on each seesaw okay so we will write two multiplied by four okay how many children are there in all isn't it so four one are four four two are eight isn't it so there are eight children in all okay so here the next one there are five swings in the park you write five up here multiplied by there are two children on each swing two now you multiply it five mm, two five r is ten you write here ten there are ten children in all now you do this one there is one rose bush in the park one you write it here multiplied by there are four roses on the bush you write four here so one multiplied four multiplied by one will be four there are four roses in all okay so you please copy this down everything in your not copy so when you turn to next page you will get the same thing okay read the problems given below to decide whether they can be solved with multiplication or addition arun has put stamps on three pages of his stamps album each page holds 10 stamps how many stamps has arun put now what we will do here is multiplication okay zero zero three r is zero one three will be three so all together it's 30 see how many stems has arun put into his album now you write he has put 30 stems okay you can write it like this there are four children each child has five daddies each child has five daddies how many daddies are there in all we will do multiplication here as well so five four r is 20 isn't it how many daddies are there in all there are 20 daddies in all jivika has four teddies ankita has five teddies how many teddies are there in all here we will do addition okay here we will do addition not multiplication multiplication is different we have used the timetable but here we will do addition okay so now what you have to do is make sticks do you remember that isn't it this is four one two three four this is five one two three four five now count everything one two three four five six seven eight nine you write here nine so this is your answer okay so this is the last 
chapter and this is the last sum for this uh, final exam you please copy down everything do all the homeworks in maths that I've given it to you and you will be getting marks for that so please show me as soon as possible copy down everything and also I'll send you some notes in maths you please copy that down in your maths copy as well thank you